Hey, good morning, everybody. Welcome to Truth Be Told. I'm so glad that you're here today to receive the truth of God. I pray that everything out of my mouth is pleasing to you, my King, and that your eyes and ears and heart is open to receive the truth, because the Word says the truth will set you free. I pray this in the glorious name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Say, so you guys are ready for the holidays. There's a lot of hustle and bustle, a lot of running to the stores, and with that, a lot of stress. Uh, in our lives, you know, a lot of anxiety, right? And they come from different things, you know, that maybe we don't have the money that we want to buy certain people that we love gifts, or it could just be just that things are not good in our lives, situations that arise. And you know, it's funny because God tells us that in this world, we will have trials and tribulations. But what does he say? He says, but be of good cheer because I have overcome the world. That's right, guys, you heard it. Jesus has overcome the world. And if you're in him, then what is the problem? I want you to know that stress it has nothing to do with your circumstances and your situation. It has to do with the way you think about the situation. Because let's just give, let's just throw some things out there. You lost your job. You're not doing well health-wise. You got a bad report from the doctor. All this is not good. I'm not saying it's good. But what does the Word of God say? Most of us don't even know what the Word of God says. So therefore, we stay in the place of the situation and the circumstance instead of moving ourselves into the place where God's power is, where God says that he has the power to overcome all those things that are going on in your life. So I pray today that instead of staying stuck like Chuck in your situation, move past that. See, God gives you the ability to get past your circumstances like an eagle flies above the storm. That's what the power of God does in your life because it's not you who lives, but Christ who lives in you. So let's get a hold of this stress and this anxiety and let's take it back to where it belongs. Just send it back to hell, honey. Let's give it back to Satan because that's where it comes from, okay? And let's stay in God's perfect peace. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray. I am on Peace Place and Surrender Street. Where are you at? Holla.